He literally turned his gaze away from me for two seconds and I came back with another item. Do I drink wine? No. No, I do not. But um, I wanted them to decorate for my bar cart. But do I have a bar cart? No, I do not. and welcome back to my channel so today I have a very spooky haul for you guys from both home goods and Marshalls so if you guys are interested then just keep on watching but before we begin let me remind you that subscribing is a hundred percent free so please click that subscribe button and while you're at it go ahead and click that notification bell so that you're notified every time that I post I post every single week and fall and Christmas time are my absolute favorite times of year so usually I have extra videos that go up during the week so trust me you don't want to miss out I think I'm first gonna just do Marshalls because that stuff is already on the table you know what let me just start with this really random item um, <laughs> this is actually dish soap but it is pumpkin spice scented dish soap so um, I had to have it this was actually in the aisleway you know leading up to the registers that is the most dangerous place because they always put like really like nice hidden gems you know around there you know what i'm talking about i should just be only let through that aisle with like blinders on or something anyways the um dish soap was 4.99 and it was perfect because i was running low on dish soap anyways and this is actually vegan and paraben free so i liked that and it is 946 milliliters the company, if you're wondering, is called Backcountry Soap Company. And it smells great, by the way. This next item doesn't have to be just for spooky season. It is a perfect little display piece. Um, and it is this right here. It's like a little cupcake, mini cake stand. <laughs> but um, I absolutely love it. And this one was only $12.99. I think it'll be nice to display something, you know, something special. All right, so I am not a Ray Dunn hunter. Dunn hunter, I think, is what they call themselves. I feel like you either really love Ray Dunn or you really hate Ray Dunn, but I actually fall right in the middle. I just I don't really care either way. As long as something looks cute to me, I will get it, but I don't go hunting for it just because it says Ray Dunn. But with that being said, I actually ended up getting a Ray Dunn piece. Not just one, but th there's a few more coming which I never thought, never thought that I would because, you know what, let me just show you. Okay, so this side says happy and this side says Halloween and there are two of them right next to each other but I know like these are really good for tiered trays which is why I wanted this, all right? Especially since this side said happy. And I love black and orange, um, even just as like a regular color combo as you can see. It just, not just for like Halloween but like just in general, I love that color combo. And so I got it. This was $5.99. I'm not a big fan of this font, all right? I'm just not. But I was just, it was early, all right? It was like in July that I got this. And I was just so ready for fall, okay? I was desperate for fall. Anything fall and they had nothing except this, nothing. Right, so that that is why I got this, okay? All right, but I still, I mean, I think it's cute. It's very interestingly shaped, as you can see. Um, it looks very handmade, <laughs> but um, I like the size of it. it. Feels very sturdy. I feel like I would have like a really good amount of drink in this. Just I wish, especially for like Halloween stuff and fall stuff. I I have like a totally different font in mind, but. I mean, like, I don't have a Cricut or anything to kind of customize my cups, even though I would love to write things out the way I want it written, but this will just have to do for now. So as I said, I am not a done collector, but this was again in the waiting aisle as I was waiting for the cash register. Literally, <laughs> my husband was like running towards the cash register because I was just like picking up things left and right. And he was like, let's go, let's go, let's go. And he was just running. And then he sees me walking up with this. And he's just like, what? He literally turned his gaze away from me for two seconds. And I came back with another item. And he was just like, how did you even, you were right behind me. And I was like, yep, this was right next to me. 
and um, it's this little Ray Dunn gift set. Uh, it comes with two candles and a room spray. Um, and I mean, this says Hocus Pocus, Witch's Brew, and Magic Potion, which is all very cute. But the scent is pumpkin spice latte. So um, yeah, I got a little excited, okay? And I can smell it through the box. And it smells so good. <laughs> you guys, it smells so good. And I mean, the packaging is pretty cute. You, you gotta admit. If I got this as a gift, I'd be pretty happy. Even if I'm not like a big Ray Dunn, Ray Dunner? Is that what they, I don't even know what they're called, but. Ah, <sighs> smells so good. And these actually, like, look how perfect they go together. What? You know, if you were to make like a little gift basket, especially for someone that loves Ray Dunn, they would go crazy over this. So I'm not a Ray Dunn collector, but when it comes to Disney, well, I'm not sure exactly what you would call me. I don't know. I'm, I, I don't go crazy over stuff. I mean, at least I don't think so. <laughs> My husband would probably beg to differ. But anyways, I found this little guy. <sighs> He's a little vampire oh my gosh what oh my i didn't even notice this oh i saw mickey and i got like i just my eyes glazed over and i was like i have to have him and this guy was 12.99 which is a little pricey but you know this came with a stuffed mickey which is so cute he's actually in his little vampire attire look how cute oh my gosh and this is a big mug I mean like big. The sticker is covering like how big the mug is, but compared to a Ray Dunn mug, let me just show you. Right here. Yeah, that's pretty big. That is pretty big. Probably have like soup out of this or something because it's just so big, but I thought it was so cute and great to decorate with as well, especially with the little plush that comes with it. I actually was not planning on getting any of these. I'm literally looking for one particular item two technically but one particular item which is um the mickey like ceramic mickey pumpkin heads if you've seen like people have been posting about it all over and i have not seen it yet like ever so hopefully i find one that's why i kept going back to home goods and marshall's because i really really wanted it but no luck no luck as of yet so um if i do find it then I will, of course, let you guys know. Moving on to the last item from Marshalls. If you know my obsession with Disney villains, then you know. These are stemless wine glasses. Do I drink wine? No. No, I do not. But um, I wanted them to decorate for my bar cart. But do I have a bar cart? No, I do not. So I basically just got wine glasses. Maybe to drink juice out of? I don't know. <laughs> But um, yes, it has Ursula, Cruella de Vil, it has a Maleficent, if I, can, I can't even turn it around because she's packaged the other way. And then it has the Evil Queen here, you can kind of see. And it has their names like written in the back. See, this kind of font is what I wanted for the mugs. This kind of like, you know, like gothic kind of print. I think that looks really cool. Uh, cooler than the Ray Dunn font, at least for me. Um, if you like Ray Dunn, please, like, I'm not dissing you at all. Everyone has their own thing that they love, but, <sighs> but I love these. And now I guess I gotta get a bar cart just to decorate, you know? <laughs> that was a set of four, and let's see, this was $12.99, which actually is not that bad for four glasses. Alrighty, so let's move on to home goods. I only got a couple of items from there. Um, one of them is this little ring light situation that I got. Um, I actually already hauled it before, but just in case you guys are looking for it, then you know where to find it because I had been looking for something like this forever and I finally found it at home goods. There's this little ring light phone holder and it has like a little clip on the bottom and everything is adjustable, which is really cool. This is what it looks like. If you saw my little decluttering videos, then you know the struggle um, that I had with trying to film with one hand and declutter with the other. So hopefully this will help me with future videos. This light can adjust from cool tone to warm tone to neutral and you can even adjust the brightness, which I thought was really cool. And then your phone goes right in here and then this is the little clip. You can clip it to the end of a desk, 
which I thought was really cool. And right here is like the little attached remote you can control the lighting with. This actually is like a USB plug-in. I would plug it in for you, but I still have not found a little cube to go with this. So uh, until I do, uh, I will not be able to use it. I actually did already plug it into my computer and it worked perfectly. I absolutely love this. I'm so happy I found it. The next item is this little wooden sign and it actually says wicked, but you know, I didn't even really notice this part. I only noticed this part because I love mermaids and this was a glittery purple mermaid i love the color purple i love mermaids and i love glitter so this was just perfect if they could just have this by itself that would have been amazing this retails for 14.99 and it is wooden wicked i mean it doesn't even remind me of like halloween or anything like that it literally reminds me every time i see this word it reminds me of the incredibles when that little kid like drives by on his bicycle and he's like that was totally wicked that was totally wicked! That is exactly what I think of when I see this word every single time. So to you, it might be Halloween, but to me, it is literally that little kid. The final item is this soft plushy throw, which I absolutely love. I have been wanting for years a soft plush throw, which were full of just pumpkins, just really cute pumpkins they didn't have to be halloween at all i just want cute pumpkins that's it and i mean i don't really care for like the witchy pumpkins or anything but this one right here this little one with this the glasses like i thought was the cutest thing ever so adorable and i asked my husband and he was like yeah that's pretty cute and so we got it and this is an oversized throw 50 by 70 inches and machine washable. This was originally $16.99, but as I was standing in the line, I noticed there was a pen mark on it. I don't know if you can see that. Do you see that? It's like right in the fold, this pen mark right here. And so I asked them if they had any other ones and they looked for me. I had already looked, but they went ahead and looked also, but they couldn't find any more. It Like the previous visit to Home Goods, there were a bunch of these and I don't know why I didn't grab it then. But, I mean, I was literally just looking for the Disney Mickey stuff that I mentioned before. But I just really like this, so I grabbed it this time. And the girl was so nice. She actually ended up giving it to me for $15, which was really great. And this is going to be so perfect to decorate with as well. So keep an eye out for my decor videos coming up. Alrighty, guys. So that is it for my Home Goods and Marshalls haul. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Give this video a big thumbs up, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!